face. Is he the hard-charging, electric, Red Bull-fueled creative genius that's ripping apart the fabric of the art scene with a fury that makes Gene Rayburn seem docile? Or is he the sensitive and fragile soul, a veritable Blanche Dubois who's trampled under the boorishness of the Stanley Kowalski of our time, Fargo, North Dakota, a city that calls the latest football chant Pulitzer-worthy, a city that doesn't even realize the magnitude of the greatness of the genius that trods along anonymously amongst its corpulent citizens. Bagface. He put on an exhibit in an abandoned Dairy Queen just outside of Fargo that was brilliant. Photos, garbage, performance art. Bagface is doing things today that nobody else has ever seen and probably will ever see again. Like Stanley Kubrick's Star Child, he gazes in wonderment at all of us, wishing mankind the peace and tranquility that he himself creates every time another of his works is born. Is it possible that he is both the firebrand and the waif? Is it possible that he is that and so much more? A persona for every mood, every whim, every need felt by those found lucky enough to gaze upon his art, his craft, his love child. Uh, I went to one of his shows and I didn't know at the time, but the show was me. He made me the show itself. And for weeks I was talking about it and talking about it. And, and I realized the show had never actually ended. And it was still about me. And I was being broadcast across the internet. I started getting letters from people. And I, I don't want to use the word genius because we're overusing it, but uh, maestro maybe? His dignity is legendary, yet he can be found any given night on his knees in some dank, putrid smelling alley, scrounging for that perfect piece of refuse to top his latest sculpture of garbage. Some say Bagface is a product of the CIA's MK Ultra program, that he gladly and knowingly ate the LSD laced Fruit Loops they served him. Or is it possible that he brainwashed the CIA and we now live in a society of Bagface's making? Could we even perceive it if he did? Can we break on through to the other side in these strange days? Can we fly the crystal ship and visit the LA woman? Would Bagface even grant us permission if we wanted to? You have to understand that Bagface tenderly embraces us all, but mostly, he just doesn't care. About you, about me, about this whole damn thing we call new Applebee's riblets. If you understand what I've been saying to you about Bagface, then you, are a moron.